everybody welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a fun one it's going to be a productive day in the life it's currently 7 45 i woke up around 6 30 i did some journaling and then i did a pilates workout and now my plan is to go to the gym it's july 1st i got a membership at one of our gyms here and i want to use it before i get back to school because my friends feline and leah were supposed to come with me i'm not sure if they're coming I don't think she's gonna pick up. Hello? So she actually did pick up, but she was dead asleep. And so I think our plan is, is we are going to wait a little bit until she's up and at him. Um, I don't know how long that'll take. So I don't really know but basically um like i said today is going to be a productive day in life i have a lot of homework that i need to get done you guys didn't know i'm taking summer classes i'm taking three so it has been definitely difficult and one of them is calc two and that class is so hard especially with like no real structure so um yeah i guess i could just get started on some of my work for that class or i could read I don't really know. I think I might read, which is like leaning off of my productive because when I get a reading, like a reading spell, I cannot stop reading. But I started Christina Lauren's The Unhoneymooners and it's really good so far. I'm only three chapters in. But I think I might go, go back inside and read that until Leah texts me. It, I'll give it until nine and by nine if I'm still ha still haven't heard anything and then i'll start doing homework but yeah i'm going to take back in my gym bag it's like hot outside and i'm wearing a hoodie and leggings and this is not the move it is 9 30 now um on the dot and i'm headed to the gym leah texts me saying she was ready and so we're headed there i told you guys i was going to start doing homework at nine but I actually didn't even, I was so absorbed into the book, which by the way, it's so good. Um, I'm on chapter 14, I think. Um, so I read about nine, 10 chapters. Um, but yeah, so I'm headed to the gym right now. Like I have said like five times, we're gonna do a leg workout. I'll probably, oh, there's a possum on the road. We'll probably keep it pretty simple just because I haven't weightlifted in a while and so I want to get accustomed to it and also I've never done weightlifting at this gym so I don't really know where everything's at but um, yeah I really hope I brought my airpods because if I didn't I hate listening to like the gym's music but it's fine. It's my schedule right now. So we're gonna work out, come home shower, I need to wash my hair we were gonna do schoolwork for like an hour. No. <laughs> Workout, shower, read for a little bit. Homework, read, homework. That is my, that's how I'm gonna do it. That way I'm getting work done, but I'm also doing what I wanna do, like reading. got back from Target. Well, I'm currently driving. I need to set my camera up. Hopefully it doesn't fall because that would really, really suck. But yeah, so Leah and I went to the gym. It is currently 1140. Um, I think we left, or I left my house at 930. And so it's been over two hours. We were, I know our workout was over 45 minutes. I think it was maybe 50-ish minutes. Um, but we worked glutes, quads, and we did a little calves. Nothing 
too intense now. Hey guys. We're headed back home. It, I'm way behind schedule than I initially thought. I thought I would be back home by like 11, 11.30 at the latest. And then, and then doing my schoolwork. It is now 12.30. Almost, it's 12.20, but basically it's uh, 12.30, which means I have three and a half hours to get ready, but really only three hours. I mean, three hours to do my homework, so we're gonna hope that we get it done soon. Uh, Leah's in front of me bopping right now. Okay guys, I am back in my room. It is 1.04. I wanted to be ready to do some homework at one. I got a 44 out of 50 on my first math assignment. 88. <laughs> okay, sorry. Be ready to go at one, but it's 105, so I almost got there. But we are just going to do some homework. I have three assignments to do tomorrow. Um, and it, what I've been doing for the past, I think this is on week four, for the past four, three, however you want to calculate it, I've basically just been doing my homework uh, the day that it's due, which is not like me. I don't know why I've been doing that, but I've also been doing that for math. And if you guys don't know, um, you can't really do that in these types of classes, especially more advanced ones like I'm in. I'm in like junior level classes for at least two of them to stop it. And I have my first calc exam um, this week. It is due. Oh wait, actually let's do next week. Yeah, I have my first calc exam next week. I had my first one for psych um, on Friday, last Friday, and I got an 80% on it, which I'm happy with, but I think I have a B in the class, which I really just wanna get an A in the class, but if I get a B, it'll be fine. It's got this in a medium and the pants in a medium. I will say they fit nicely. They're, I just feel like they're a little short. I am 5'7", so maybe that's why but I really like it it's super comfy I'm feeling very fresh and clean and I love that feeling so excited about that We're wallpaper I'm on Katie Bilotti's um patreon and she comes out with new um themes but I did this like white with a little pink like it's kind of fuzzy and it says collect beautiful moments and then I also got the same one on my laptop um it just has the July and then the dates and then collect beautiful moments I signed up for her Patreon last month, so this is only my second month being on it. I think all the stuff she has on there is really cute. So if you guys like Katie Bilotti, I recommend um, just going on there and <laughs> checking it out. to be done at two o'clock so i'm very happy getting done before then but yeah i just submitted that and now i need to do my discussion posts um the discussion posts are kind of intense i mean like i'll probably finish in 30 minutes i hope i hope it's not longer than that but i'm gonna take a three minute brain break and get on my phone and just have a brain break like i said or I could read a chapter. I think I'm gonna read a chapter. I'm gonna read a chapter. Okay. Okay guys, I read a chapter. It's 202, so only two minutes over. Um the book just got good, so I'm really wanting to read right now. So I think I made a mistake choosing to read, but we're going to get this discussion board over with. So okay. I wanted or I thought I would be done in like within 30 minutes at the most and I was that one was honestly probably one of the hardest that one was probably one of the hardest uh, discussion posts our professor doesn't let us see anyone else's responses before 
you submit obviously there's a reason to that that way you're not copying off of people um but i felt like i needed some guidance but i just kind of did it and then i looked at other people's responses that chose the same question as me and i'd say it was pretty similar um of course i always learn something that i should add when i use someone else's we also have to respond to someone's discussion post so i did that but yeah like i said it's 2 30 i could do my third psychology assignment but at this point i just really don't want to i have an hour until i need to um get ready for work and i'm kind of hungry so i have half of the salad uh half of the salad upstairs from my lunch today and i think i'm gonna eat that and honestly just read this book i'm on chapter 15 and i think there's only 20 chapters but then there's an epilogue i always count that as another chapter so this book has 21 i would say but yeah i'm gonna go upstairs and eat and read this book okay guys it is 3 17 i finished the unhug members and boy was it good i love this so much i feel like it's normal for every romance to have like a rift before it ends so like they get together they're happy something happens and then they're fighting and then they get back together and so i was not expecting the rift that happened and so i thought that was really cool when you can't predict exactly what's gonna happen i think that always makes a book interesting really quick guys i just wanted to show you the workout outfit i got from target so this is from their like all in motion or whatever um brand but yeah i just got this like magenta fuchsia i don't really know what this color um is called it's like a razor back i don't know it's just like a tank top and then i got these biker shorts i actually really like them um they have a pocket and then they have the drawstring to tighten it but yeah, i really like this outfit i think i'm gonna wear it tomorrow um to the gym i'm still trying to decide if i want to work out in the morning or the evening but um yeah i'm gonna get ready for work real fast okay guys we are back in my room the mood is set for bed i'm back in my target sweatsuit retainer is in which means it is time for bed but yeah this is going to be the end of this productive vlog hopefully it seemed a little productive basically just to make myself <laughs> myself feel better i'm gonna do a rundown so i woke up at 6 30 i did a pilates workout it was really nice i was gonna go to the gym at 8 but i happened to go to the gym at 9 30. i finished the book i did two assignments i did a four hour shift um i ate some dinner you know um i got some new clothes and now i'm going to bed so yeah it was a somewhat productive day um it felt nice i also did my hair i guess i can mention that but um yeah, I am ready for the new day tomorrow. Tomorrow I work all day, literally 8.30 to 9 p.m. But by 9 p.m. it's usually like 9.30. But yeah, we're excited. Um, I set up some stuff with my dad as well. This was some like off camera stuff. I am getting a new license plate and I'm gonna get a credit card. So I actually just got done like setting that up for next Wednesday to do. So some adult theme, but yeah, I'll show you guys the books that I'm going to start reading probably tomorrow while I'm babysitting in the morning. If you guys don't know, I have two jobs. I work as a babysitter for a family and then I work at my calipsters. So tomorrow I babysit and work at my calipsters. But while I'm there, I will probably do my other psych exam and then for the rest of the time I'll be reading. So tomorrow I at least want to read one chapter of the uh tracy kidder mountains beyond mountains like my one must uh july read like i have to read this by the end of july or at least i really want to so so i think it would be good to at least read one chapter i think i'm gonna try to annotate this um i don't want to put sticky notes in it just because it's not mine i mean i don't want to put like tabs in it because it's not mine but i think i'll put sticky notes that way it's easier to remove and then the other book i have is the lisa jewel um, novel it's called the invisible girl or invisible girl i read then she was gone it was such a good book i read it in one day actually while i was babysitting so i hope this book is just as good or you know even better but yeah those are to my those are my two books i want to read 
gonna go ahead and head to bed hopefully you guys enjoyed this video i had a lot of fun vlogging i'm trying to get back into it my content has mostly been book videos which i really enjoy doing so i'm definitely not going to stop doing those but i also want to start getting back into blogging and just capturing stuff in my in my days because when i go back to school that is a big part of it but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and go have a great afternoon morning night whenever you guys are watching this and i'll talk to you very soon peace and love bye guys